Welcome to the Business Responsibilities and Society course. My name is Duncan Pelly, and I'll be your instructor over the next 15 lessons. In my very biased opinion, this is one of the most interesting courses that you'll have during your university career because it has just a little bit of something for everyone. If you like history, we're going to talk about history. If you like philosophy, that plays a big part in this course, especially in the study of ethics. If you like economics, that will be there. If you like political science, we have several chapters on that. If you like sociology, don't worry, that will be liberally covered. So what we're going to be looking at are a variety of things that managers may face. We may be looking at things like what is legitimate or illegitimate behavior when a manager interacts with society. We'll be looking at how business, government, and society may appear to have very different sets of interests. Or do they? Can they not sometimes find a common ground? So one of the biggest questions that we get asked are, what is involved in the business, government, and society field? Well, first of all, you guessed it, we look at businesses. What do you think of businesses? It's basically some sort of a profit-making activity designed to satisfy basic human needs. Now, profit, that's kind of an ambiguous term. Um, sometimes we look at profit in terms 